Hey y'all, Ileana Silver Dragon, and here we are with another part of Let's Play Star Stable. So I am right by James, so we can continue with the pony quest. Yeah. Hi Ileana, I have just ordered new jumps and signs for Penny and Polly's pony competition. You can apologize to them for me. I really didn't mean to push the box with the things in it off the cliff so everything would break. I don't really know what happened. I just kind of tripped and pushed a box several meters to the edge. And then I stumbled again and happened to give it a really hard push and it went over the edge. Really bad luck, right? Mm-hmm. But now I've ordered new equipment. It cost me a bit of money, but it'll be worth it. My stomach is feeling better already. Strange, right? You think those two things are related? It was my bad conscience that made my stomach hurt. Ha, you're funny, Ileana. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anyway, you can ride back to Penny and Polly and say hi for me. The jumps have already been taken there and assembled, so everything is ready. Hmm, you know, maybe this pony competition isn't such a bad idea after all. The smart bit is I get to let Penny and Polly try first, so I get to learn from any mistakes they make. After that, I can start an even better pony competition here in Fort Pinta. Brilliant. Ow. Now that pain in my stomach is back again. Ow. I don't know why my stomach is doing this to me. Ow. Bye, Eliana. Ow, ow, ow. Poor me. Yeah, uh-huh. You're doing that to yourself. So, let's head over to Pony Point and try the race. I think this is where we try the race. Alright, just <clears throat> heading over there. Um, I am sorry that I haven't recorded in a while because, oh hey, a token. No. Oh. Fun. Um, yeah, I am sorry I haven't recorded in a while. Um, work has been really busy since quarantine was lifted. Um, everyone wants to suddenly take vacations, and that means boarding their dogs. Okay. Hello, Ileana. This is fantastic. We've received new jumps from James, and he helped us put them up. It's very kind of him. Maybe he isn't as awful as we thought. I don't know about that. There, Ileana. Now it's all set. All the jumps are in place, and so now we just need to ride the course from start to finish. Only ponies are allowed in this race, but that's pretty clear, right? Good luck. Well, let's go ahead and go. Okay, come on, Shade. Um, I will try to record tomorrow, because, of course, Talina and Compos are coming out tomorrow, and I want them. <laughs> like, bad. I want them bad. <laughs> They're so pretty. Um, I will have to look at names because I have absolutely no clue <laughs> what I would name them. Okay. Man, this is hard with low level. Okay, so Shade definitely turns in the air. Um, I think that's a pony thing because... Uh, Shinko Teig on my main account does the same thing. I don't think my old model does it. I don't know. I haven't tried it. I didn't notice it when I was training it. Hmm. Um. Also, does the Connemara do it? Because that's also a... Isn't that technically a pony? I don't know. I have a Connemara on my uh, story account, but I don't... Hmm. Um, I'll have to try that out in my own time. Beautifully ridden, beautifully ridden, Ileana. It's so nice to meet a fellow pony fan, especially one with skills like you have. We put up a race board if you want to try again for a better time. And if you'd like to train with any of your ponies and earn some extra shillings, come back tomorrow for a daily training session. Yay! E Shade is now level 2. 
Okay, so I think we'll head up to Silverglade. No, maybe Steve's farm? Give him his cat. And then we'll head up to his cat and bird feed, I think. Um, yeah, cat substitute and ask for bird feed. And then we'll go to whose horse is that at the equestrian center. So that's what we'll do. Just have to ride there first. <clears throat> oh. Oh, we just discovered golden fields. Oh, I forgot this thing was here. This disappears after you do a certain quest. What quest is that? It has something to do with chipmunks, I think. Uh, we'll ride through Barney's field. Is that Barney? I have no clue. Their names are so similar, and they're all—they all look the same. No, I can't see his name. Oh well. <coughs> Okay. Oh, I stopped a little too soon. Okay. Okay, buddy. I've got the mouse traps, but as you can see, I'm very busy and can't put them out myself right now. Maybe you could help me? Please? Before the mice eat up the entire farm. Take these and spread them out in different places. You're lucky you weren't here this winter that much, I'll tell you. Never seen such a winter. Thought I was in Siberia it was that cold. I felt sorry for the birds. How were they supposed to find food? And now these mice seem to have eaten all the seeds I left in the store. If there's someone who has a good quantity of seed, it's Barney over at the silo. Can you go over and ask him for some? Sure. Um, I'll do the mouse traps first. This would be three. Nope. Four. Five. Where is that one? Is it inside the barn? Oh, it is. Oh, right next to it. And six. Now we'll go ask Barney for some uh, bird seed. now. Stop it. Okay. Oh, it is Barney. Seeds for the birds? They had a rough winter, eh? We all did, didn't we? I said to the wife that if I didn't know better, I'd say that some gruesome dark power reigned over the island last winter. But maybe I'm just getting old. Older than last year, anyway. Oh, so we'll have to wait for that. So, now let's go back to Steve. Um. Okay. Nicely done, girl. I don't know where the, all the mice are coming from. During night, I hear strange sounds from underground. I wonder if GED are drilling in the island of Yorick from the inside out. Now we just need something to use as bait. Hmm, my friend at the mill, Will the Millman. Millman? 
There's plenty of cheese in storage. Maybe you can ask him for some old cheese that we can use as bait. He lives near the windmill north of here. You can't miss it. Sure, I'll go get it from him. How much Talina and compost will cost? Because I really don't want to buy star coins. I eh, probably will have to. Mm, we'll see. <laughs> Steve has problems with my set of farm. I see. Well, I don't want to hurt the little cute little animals. Let me think what we can do to solve this. Give me a second and talk to me again in a while. Here, I have some cheese. My smelliest cheese ever. This will do the trick, but Steve will never understand why. You see, the cheese stinks so bad that the mice will flee the farm. This way we make both Steve and the mice happy. Good solution, eh? So, here you are. Take this to the farm. Hey, if you ever need cheese again, feel free to come here, even if I'm not here. My cheese is your cheese. Sure, I like cheese. Uh, ride back to Steve real quick. Oh. Oh, really? I don't want to stop. Heading up to Steve, and then we'll head over to the manor to continue with the story quest. Whoa, what is that horrible smell? Oh, I see the cheese. Well, great, I guess. Now you just need one more thing for me. Now you just need to do one more thing for me. Can you please place this very smelly cheese as bait in the traps? Good. That will so solve the problem for me until my cat returns. Hurry up and save my farm. One. Come yeah, on. Hi, Justin. Two. Three. Four. Five. And six. Okay. Well done. I hope this is the end of the mouse invasion and saved the farm. Farmhouse. I still wonder what's going on underground during the night. That may be the reason for the mouse invasion, but I can't look into that now. Oh, a new shirt. This one's still better. Um, I also want to look here real quick, because I never really look at the styles. Put your head up. I do like this one, but I like the original better. <laughs> okay, so now let's head up to the manor. So we can go talk to Khan. Well, talk to ourselves asking who is Khan. <laughs> I think that's how you pronounce his name. I do love this horse pony. It's so cute. Hang on a sec. I need to discover this real quick. Oh, I don't need to discover it? Weird. Hey. Okay. Back on our way.
All right. Over the bridge and up the hill. Don't stop or slow down. horse looks familiar. Haven't you seen it somewhere before? It looks very distinctive with that glistening black coat and staring eyes. Creepy. Wait, that mysterious light. It's the same light you saw when that masked rider came by Moreland's stable. Came by Moreland and stole Thomas's deed to the stable. You need to ask someone whose horse that is. Ask Tira? Tyra? Who owns the horse? Yep, I know exactly who owns that horse. <sighs> Sorry about that. <sighs> what? Khan? His owner is a girl named Sabine. She's standing over there. She's rather new here. I think she came about a week ago. I remember that Linda showed her around. That must have been the last time Linda was here, by the way. I wonder what happened to her. Was she out riding last night in Moreland? Well, a few days ago, but whatever. <laughs> I have no idea. Ask her yourself. Doesn't it seem a bit odd, though, to be out riding in the middle of the night? Yeah. Ask Sabine if she was riding. Why would you ask her yourself? She's obviously not going to tell the truth. Uh, sometimes these characters are so stupid. <laughs> Sabine. Um, what? I certainly have not been out riding in the middle of the night. Who are you, by the way, to come here with your stupid inquisitions? Excuse me? What are you implying here, exactly? That I was in Moreland? What would I be doing in that pathetic place when there are much better riding tracks here? You know what? You need to learn how to behave around other people, that's for sure. You act like you're five years old or something. Please spare me the baby talk. I wish I could trample you. I really do. And now you're going to ask me about the riding track too? Oh my goodness. You're unbelievable. Just leave me alone, will you? If you feel a desperate need to bother someone, bother the stable girls. I'm sure they're dying to hear what you have to say. I don't like you. The riding track? You didn't know about that? It's right over there. Try it out if you like. Will do. I like the riding track. These are fun. <laughs> if a bit long. Um, that is in the main story, right? Yeah. So we'll continue with that. Hi, you want to try out the track? Go on, I'll watch. I'm Pauline, by the way. Okay. Let's try it out. Nope, nope, too far. Okay. Over this. Jump and jump. Okay. Man, this is a uh, much faster on a higher level with a higher level horse.
Honestly, the horse level doesn't really feel like anything when you're, um, when you're a higher level. They kind of all feel the same, really. Okay, almost done. Oh great, what are you? Great track, right? I'm quite proud of it actually. I mean, not that it's mine or anything, but you know, being able to use it and all. It's been, I've been to uh, some of the other tracks in the area and they just can't compete with this one. I don't want to sound like a snob or anything, I'm just thankful I guess. <laughs> Sometimes I just can't up, can't j just can't shut up, can I? It's great seeing you anyway. See you around, Eliana. What do you want? Well, that was great. Hey, I thought about the talk we had before. We didn't get off to a very good start, did we? I guess I was feeling a little insecure or whatever. I'm new here, you know? Would it be too much to ask you for a small favor? Why don't we start over and get to know each other? Yeah? So what's your name? Eliana? Hi, Eliana. I'm Sabine. Friends? No. Really? You will? Ugh. Thank you. We'll have so much fun together. Gosh, I'm so glad we worked that out. So, what are you doing here? So, what are you doing now? You don't happen to know Justin Moreland by ch any chance. You do? That's fantastic. Okay, so I've got this letter for Justin from some uh, sort of unknown relative. He needs to get it, but as you know, I'm not all that familiar with the man outside the manor. I'm sure I couldn't find my way back here if I got lost. You know your way around Moreland, don't you? <laughs> Wait, what? Ride there together? No way, I cannot be seen over there. Not with my status. I have to keep the classier areas. I'm sure you understand. Not really. Please, write to Moreland and give this letter to Justin. Ugh, fine. Okay, let's go, um... Get this letter to. Where are you? What the? Where are you? Justin's supposed to be right here. What? Wait, what? Like this. This is where the exclamation mark is. Huh? Who's Emily? Is that you? Still. Why is he not here? <laughs> Oh, that is Emily. What the actual... Okay, hang on a second. I'm gonna try something. Well, that's a glitch. A fun one, but a glitch. Emily. Show up now? Whoa, 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 whoa. It looks a lot different. I've never actually done this. Okay. <laughs> Justin, please be there. What the actual? Where is he? What? I'm so confused. Um, I'll try Steve's farm? That's the only place I know he is. I'm so confused. <laughs> I might just have to end the episode. Because <laughs> I don't want it to put y'all through logging out and logging back in. Nope. What in the world? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's annoying. <laughs> Help. That might just have to wait a little bit. Um. Oh my goodness. What in the world? 
Okay, so, um... Um, I, I guess I'll... Stop? I mean, I'm so confused. Um, I guess that's gonna be the end of the episode. It's been going on for a while. Um, yeah. So, thanks for watching, y'all. Bye!